slightly concerned about the influence of the moving image and the change that it was having on the Irish population. Really what we have is the story of Ireland on moving image. It's really important that the material isn't just here locked up and protected in an archive. It has to be a living, breathing collection and that's why we do so many screenings. It's why we bring things out on DVD. We deal with something like 53 different festivals around the world every year. I love IFI because it's a space for cinephiles like me, you know, addicted to film from an early age. They're willing to show movies that aren't happy, they are true to life. Yes, I basically live in the IFI. It's my favourite place in Dublin, it's like my temple. I was able to see the first film I actually saw in the IFI back in 1993. The art um, gives me reasons to think. So I went around the IFI film shop here. They have quite an extensive collection. What's brilliant about the Rules of Attraction is the narrative based on a book by Brett Easton Ellis. It starts mid-sentence and it ends mid-sentence. What time did you get here this morning? Uh, seven. Have you been here last year for the open weekend as well? I was, yeah. And were you first in the queue as well? <laughs> yes. I think the atmosphere is good and the restaurant isn't bad either. Just one, one fridge. Yes. Okay. <laughs> 